Good morning. Good morning. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday to y'all. I think I well, I put up a short earlier. But anyway, I'm headed to service over in Memphis. I um going over in Memphis. I was gonna go in South Haven, but I ended up um I have um Amber had had some groceries delivered from Walmart. And I, um, got about 12 or 13 items on yesterday and I forgot to change the address and they delivered to her house so I gotta go pick that stuff up plus I had some stuff for, um, I had uh, got off of the TikTok shop that I had to do a promotional on and I had to take those over there for her nieces and nephews some clothing items for them I got a couple more uh, things coming in like that her little nephew can use for school, like some pants that I have to do. But I'll take those. She can come get them when she comes down here or something like that. I gonna, I'm going to see her on the 4th because I think we're going to go over to one of my girlfriend's house who's having a gathering. And um, she invited us. I hadn't decided yet, but I told Amber we may go over there. You know, to a, I know I'm not barbecuing, so I gotta find something to take because I don't like to go to any function um, empty handed. So uh, I'll get Amber to go and bring a dessert or a watermelon or something. I might ask her if she needed any because she need us to bring something or what particularly. But I know last year, um, well, maybe for the year before last, we went and um, might have been last year, might have been last year, and um. I, it wasn't any desserts or anything there, so I may stop by Sam's and get some cakes or cookies or something like that, you know, for the little kiddos to have something sweet also to eat because, you know, children love them some junk food. So, yeah, that will be that on that. But anyway, I hope y'all are starting your Sunday out great and you're doing something if you're headed to service. It's luckily, it's casual Sunday, so I just threw something casual on today. And, um, well, you can go come as you are any day, but I, you know, deliberately, I just got some pants on and some little jean jacket uh, today. I made, if y'all don't watch my shorts, I mean, I did put it up to shorts what I had on, but uh, I will post it. I'll try to remember when I get home to kind of post it. I'll show y'all what I ordered yesterday from the store too. So, um, I won't be stopping at all these. I had my mouth set for some taco salad yesterday, right? Right. Uh, either a, like a taco or something. So, I had ordered some tortillas and I had ordered the ground turkey to make it. I just told her to put the ground turkey in the freezer because I don't even know if I want that today. I didn't take nothing out to cook today by the way but it's always something that I can throw together because I'm trying to I'm, I'm trying to figure out I have a week of vacation that I carried over that I got to use by the end of August I'm trying the first of the month is really busy and my birthday is actually on a Saturday this year so I'm trying to determine what week I want to take off in August. I am going to, my girlfriend's actually gonna be back here on the 24th, she said, from Tampa. And I was thinking about going to see her for a couple of days. And uh, yeah, making that drive, maybe spend the weekend and drive on back and then just have the rest of the week to kind of kick it around here and <clears throat> do what I want to do. But that's what my thought process is because I can make that drive in a day, rest up that night, and uh, just kind of hang that Saturday and Sunday and kind of drive back Monday is what I'm thinking, but I just don't know what week I want to do it. At any rate, y'all, I'm not going to run my mouth the whole time going to service. I'm going to get off here and uh, y'all, I'm so sorry this week. Oh, I'm going to say this too. I have been so just exhausted. I know people think, I'm going to talk about YouTube for a minute on the way. And YouTube is social media, period. You know, I work full time. I've just been exhausted, but I've still been trying to keep some type of schedule going on, especially on YouTube and more so on YouTube and TikTok, you know, trying to keep it going and trying to keep, you know, and I haven't been really answering comments like I need to because you have to realize you have to be engaged on all your platforms. And it's been rough, so 
I thank y'all for hanging in there with me. You know, if you embark on this, and I think a lot of people think it's just real simple, but it's work involved in doing this as well. So, you know, and it's, um, I definitely don't want to make YouTube a job. I started YouTube for fun. I'm thankful to be earning something from it, but I still wanted to have that fun element to it. So I kind of slacked back last month on posting you know, I noticed y'all probably not. I supposed to a little bit less last month because I said I don't want to make it where I'm dredged doing it. I still want YouTube to be just a home, another place like home. You know, and the, the, the TikTok is some work. <laughs> TikTok is work, work. Ooh, Jesus, is work. But anyway, we ain't gonna talk about that today. But I still want this to be fun. And I'm sorry I had been answering really in the comments, but I'm gonna try to get back to it in next month. In July, this is the last day of June, so I said I'm gonna try to kick back it up, kick it back up. I don't know, but I'm gonna be posting a lot more because I'm grinding over there on TikTok. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. And plus, working full time, but I'm gonna try to do a little bit better about at least being engaged in the comments. And hopefully, this month I'll get a chance to do a live too. And I'm going to make it my business to try to do a live uh, in July. But anyway, I'm going to get off here right now. And I will talk to y'all after service today. I may or may not tape in the service today. I don't know. Uh, I'll just see how I feel today. If he's uh, See how I feel today. Anyway, I'll check with y'all in a little bit. I'll call y'all back. Well, church service was good. I enjoyed it, y'all. I'm out here at Amber's house now waiting for her to come out. But uh, um, it was a good service. One of my friends called me, and she was saying she wanted to go with me one Sunday because she saw I posted this morning. She watched follows me on Facebook. And she saw my post this morning on Facebook saying I was getting ready to go to church. And so she wanted to go. Uh, and I told her that I have an 8 o'clock service next Sunday, but she's going to go with me the following Sunday out there because she said she likes to go to the early service so 
that would be good. She's a member of World Old Commerce, and she said they used to have 8 o'clock service. They no longer have it, so I do like the early service. I like to go on in and go on out. But anyway, I need to go ahead and stop and get me some gas so I don't have to be fooling around with fumbling around with going to the gas station. It's hot out here, and they uh, they doing community outreach. They're not having 1030 service today. They're doing community outreach service in the community, you know, and um, uh, doing things, helping people with food and stuff like that. And I'm like, it's already hot. And it's, you know, they told the people that was going to do it to meet in the sanctuary afterwards. The next Sunday, they're not having the 8 o'clock service, like I said. So I might go out to South Haven. If I go next Sunday, I'll go. Because I don't go every Sunday, you know. Sometimes I do my service right at the house. But if I go next Sunday, I'll go out to the 9 o'clock service out in South Haven. And uh, Amber Moore likely will still sleep because it's taking her a minute to come outside. To come out there. I was looking. Now, these old guys used to sit at the end of the, end of the street. And, um. Uh, out there and now they have really fenced they they somebody bought that property and they really fenced it off i guess to try to circumvent them from sitting out there and uh having you know their little gatherings but i don't think they're stopping nothing i think those gentlemen still sit it was, it was like a little park out there they used to gather so it just seemed strange to see that part fenced in for them you know the, whoever bought the property to see that part you know fenced in away from people being able to to sit out there like they were. I wonder what it's going to be. What business is they going to put there at the end of her street once they put it there? What business that's going to be and how that's going to, you know, either prevent them or have them in there or not in there. But anyway, oh, this girl was taking her forever to come out here. I told her I was coming. Good grief. don't seem to have herself together. She must have been up late last night. The birds are chirping. Uh, she must have been asleep because she got cameras all around her house. So she, she know that we don't see me driving up in the driveway. Knocked out. It's hot out here already. I thought you was gonna put your gutter. You need to ask Gerald when he put your gutter back up. Oh, it done came down again. You gotta get that stuff out the car. You gotta go get something else. You might as well break some of them in because you got a lot to carry. This is the uh, thing for the Simone. Now, it's brand new. The box just beat up. This is uh, a car thing for her. Oh, yeah, it's hot. And then they going to do outreach ministry in the neighborhood. And I'm like, it's already hot. I don't know, but we can't outreach. I'm sorry. It's warm. It's warm. Oh, that's some stuff I had to do taste tests on. You can get that to the kids. It's some crackers and some sweets. That's them, that's that stuff for Lisa, them short sets, and these are the shirts. You can get that when you come back because you gotta carry that. You gonna carry it all at one time? Get a shirt. Send Simone uh, the, the video on how that thing works just in case, like she be like you, don't understand. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Anyway. One of Amber's little friends so needed a car, jump off, sorry, and I, so you know, I showed y'all that. And so I brought it over here so Amber can give it to her so she can have one in her car too. They about the same age, you know. And she done been stuck in situations before and I told her she needed one, but you know how these young folks are. They say they gonna do something. They don't necessarily move to do it right away. Make sure she give me all my groceries. She be trying to keep some of my groceries. Was this turkey thing the only thing in the freezer? What else was in the freezer? The rice. Oh, okay. I was like, why this out the bag? 
So you took some stripes on them. <laughs> yeah, I thought so. Inch away. I'm going to make my way on to South Haven. I got to get some gas. I'm going to go and fill my car because I'll get there to use that 30 cents since the day the last day. I'm at a half, well, a little bit under the half a tank, but I might well fill it on up and get the benefits of that 30. Well, you going on in, baby. I'm going to head on to Mississippi. This is hard. Yeah, it's a little warm out here already. So, guess what? Yeah, we well, let's just think about it. Let me see what I want to do. I'm trying to figure out what I want to do for my birthday week. But wherever I go, I ain't going to stay about two days, no ways, because this is too expensive right now. Yeah, but Amber, if I go to Tampa, that's more than that. That's what I'm saying. You act like whatever we do, we're going to do on a day. So I'm trying to cut these hotel visits out. I don't want to take but a hotel, but a couple of two or three nights. I got a budget. I got my birthday, so I'm on a budget. I know you don't believe in budgeting, but I do. Anyway. Anyway, go on in. Oh, Amber, it's kind of sad. How to, I didn't realize that fence was going to go back. It's right up on the main driveway. The fence. <coughs> and then, <coughs> then they got... <coughs> then they got what you can't even see in the fence. I said, they cutting up down there. They got a green, they got the green stuff all around now, so you can't even see in the fence. If you go back by there, you will see what you can't see in the fence now. Well, the man was up there closing the fence, so he might have did it today. But I'm like, they right up against the man driveway. I said, no, it ain't clear now. Well, what do they, they still be sitting out there? I hope they still sit out there. But they ain't got nowhere but they driveway. That Amber. But you know they sit out here all year, Amber. <clears throat> but it's kind of sad that they have really this. Yeah, cause they don't try. I mean, they they really trying to show them. Cause I didn't know. I thought maybe part of that property was there. Cause you know they were still sitting up there by the trees. I said, oh, that's right up there by the driveway. I didn't realize. It. Yeah, but when you look, I'm, it'll be interesting. I can't. Oh, Amber. Oh, let me get off here. Y'all going to ask her something. I didn't realize them some nice apartments on Broad Street. They are nice. See, you don't go to church. I'm out here pumping my gas now, y'all. I'm stopping. It is hot already out here. I'm going to take my hind parts in that house, and that's where I'm going to be for the rest of the day. I have no need to go in. The only reason why I came on to the gas station, I had enough gas to last. Like I said, I was just right under the half of a tank, but I um I um had 30 cents off and today was the last day to use it, so I ain't no need to let me go away. So I'm thinking it'll hold. I put 22 in and I'm hoping it holds 22. Normally be like 35 to fill up, 30, between 33 and 35. But 30 cents off. It's like two dollars and fifty nine cents a gallon. How much is gas where y'all at? How much is gas where y'all? I think it's gonna hold it because it's up to eighteen dollars now. So, and it's going pretty fast. It's going pretty fast. So we shall see. Oh, it's a yeah. It's got this. It's got this twenty two. I'm hoping this puts it up because y'all know I can't stand pumping gas. So I'm hoping it puts it on up to twenty to put it on up to full. Put it on up to full. Somebody behind me. So. I'm gonna get my foot in this car and keep it on a moving, keep it on a moving. Oh, come on through with it. Oh yeah, it made it, y'all, it made it. I came right at the right time, y'all, because, I mean, it's a line everywhere, every which way for folks trying to get some petrol. To get the petrol. Let me get out this woman's way. Let me hold on. Woo! Y'all, 
I'm sweating just from being out there. They've been a few little minutes pumping gas. Pump, let me go over here. I think I'm going to go to Sam Cooper and go on the expressway instead of going on further down. Going on further down. I'm going to get on Sam Cooper and whip it on. Yeah, they got the best taco truck at, um, oh, it's closed down here. Let me turn around. I'm going to have to. That's forgot. I forgot they were doing the um, road work down here. So that part. But anyway, yeah. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I'm gonna get off here. I'll talk back with y'all when I get home. Cause I'm over here just being nosy, trying to see what's going on. Cause I don't get in Memphis all that often. And then I've been seeing some new stuff that I was telling them about these new apartments they had over on Broad. And I was talking to my girlfriend about it. They are real nice. But anyway, let me get off here, y'all. I'll talk to y'all when I get to the house. Whew. Okay, y'all, I done got in here. Oh, this was my outfit of the day for church. Like I said, it was casual Sunday today. So I got on these little flare leg pants, white top, and a jean, little short crop jean jacket. So I told y'all I had my uh, grocery delivered to Amherst by accident. So some mini Coke Zeros. This romaine lettuce looking kind of toe up in a couple of spots. Some romaine lettuce tarts. Some baby spinach. Some beef smoked sausage. Y'all already know my old faithful my cucumber, cucumber, I got to cut it up anyway, but it's kind of soft to me. I don't like, I don't like that Walmart that her stuff comes from at all. Cheesy rice and broccoli. It's sad to say some of the neighborhoods, some of the Walmarts being determined the quality of your stuff. Um, the ground turkey, a roll of ground turkey. <clears throat> I've been wanting to try this some pickle asparagus and y'all when I wash my hands I'm gonna try it for y'all. Some low carb zero carb tortillas. Y'all already know how many bananas? How many bananas? <laughs> my two bananas. I open up my jar of Vaseline and I like the kind of cocoa butter. Um, I just opened it up, but I would like to have one already ready to go. So that's for the stock. I needed some more. Oops. Hold on one second, y'all. Uh, I needed some more AAA batteries. Got me one of the little mini chocolate chip muffins. Can of sour cream and onion Pringles. And y'all already know my personal watermelon. So that was my little haul from yesterday. But anyway, I'm going to get off here, y'all, and I'm going to make it do what it do, put this stuff up, and I'm going to try to say, oh, I said I was going to taste this for y'all. Hold on one second. Have y'all had the pickle, um, My hand's feeling a lot better since I've been wearing that, that brace, by the way, y'all. <clears throat> Let's taste this. It does smell bad, but it, let me see how it tastes. Have y'all had the pickled asparagus? <clears throat> yeah. This is good, y'all. 
Mmm, that's real good. This will be on the list for a repeat buy. Yes, it will. Anyway, like I said, I'm going to get off here. I'm going to try to edit and get this up at a decent time. But I want you to know you're loved. I love you. But God truly loves you the most. Remember to always be kind to yourself and others. Be joyful and be blessed. And y'all have yourself a happy and joyful Sunday all on purpose. Don't let anybody steal your joy. Love you much. Bye.